Good morning, welcome to Breakfast with Dan Walker and Sally Nugent. Headlines for you at six o'clock. <laughs> Emmanuel Macron has been re-elected as the French president. He vowed to unite the country after defeating the far-right candidate Marine Le Pen. President Zelensky has met the United States' top diplomat, the first time a senior US official has visited Ukraine since the war began. No time to wait. Rob Burrow urges the government to free up £50 million of funding for motor neurone disease after researchers say they haven't received a penny so far. Use it or lose it. That is the warning to people with these little plots of paradise as waiting lists for allotment spots keep on growing and growing. Back on Manchester City's tail, Liverpool's victory over Everton moves them to within a point of top spot, leaving their Merseyside rivals deep in relegation trouble. Good morning. There'll be some sunny spells around today, but at times, large areas of cloud producing some scattered showers. It's also going to be less breezy, but a bit cooler than yesterday. I'll have all the details throughout this morning's programme. Good morning. It's Monday. It's the 25th of April. The top story this morning is that Emmanuel Macron has vowed to unite France and be a...